Is it a good idea to get a Georgian passport? As a Georgian citizen today, I will share with you all the benefits of having it. The Georgian passport currently ranks 49th according to the Guide Passports Ranking Index. It provides visa-free access to 73 countries. Uh, Georgian passport holders have visa-free access and visas on arrival to countries such as Brazil, Thailand, Israel, Dubai and the entire European Union. But there are some destinations where a prior visa is required, like the United States, the UK, China and Japan. Today we will discuss what it's like to travel with a Georgian passport. My name is Liga Tinsabad. I'm a business and immigration attorney in Tbilisi, Georgia, and you're watching an exclusive miniseries with Nomad Capitalists. Well, the visa liberalization process was quite a journey for Georgians. In 2016, the European Commission presented a proposal to allow visa-free travel to the Schengen area for Georgian citizens. The Council reached an agreement with the European Parliament on visa liberalization for Georgia on December 2016. Uh, the agreement provides for visa-free travel uh, for uh, EU citizens and citizens of Georgia for a period of stay of 90 days in any 180 days. In 2017, the Council adopted a regulation on visa liberalization for Georgians traveling to the EU. Uh, Ireland and United Kingdom are exempted uh, from the application of these provisions by the protocols annexed to uh, the EU treaties. The regulation entered into force on 28 March uh, 2017. Visa-free travel is possible for the following purposes tourism, visiting family members, relatives or friends, business trips, uh, participation in international seminars, conferences and exhibitions, uh, participation in training, exchange or internship programs, for the use of medical services, short-term treatment or surgery. Uh, this process extremely helped relationships between the EU and Georgia and the path to EU membership itself. The documents that you will need while traveling are a biometric passport issued during the last 10 years, valid for at least three months from the date of leaving the EU Schengen zone, a valid return uh, travel ticket or a valid booking of uh, a ticket. You also need a booking of a hotel or other accommodation, uh, travel insurance and financial capability for traveling. If a person is participating in conferences, seminars or official meetings, in addition to the documents listed above, it is recommended for a passenger to have an invitation to this event. Georgian citizens are fortunate to have an opportunity to travel visa-free to many countries as it has some solid benefits.
uh, one of the most significant benefits is that it saves time and money. Moreover, it means that citizens uh, uh, don't need to fill out the application form, provide their uh, confidential information and prepare additional documentation. But of course, nothing is too perfect. I remember one time my friend was traveling from Georgia to Estonia with an invitation letter. I believe her relative invited her and when this happened, uh, you don't need to provide hotel booking and financial capability. But this invitation letter was lacking a stamp from Estonian embassy. She couldn't go through the procedure and couldn't travel. This kind of thing uh, happened a lot uh, before uh, visa liberalization. Uh, now everything is easier. You can buy a ticket and prepare your documents and you're halfway there. I myself travel a lot through uh, Europe and have to say that never had an issue anywhere when it comes to crossing the border or traveling. So from Georgia traveling is pretty easy. Almost everything is digitalized. Uh, you can even travel with your Georgian ID uh, card to Turkey and Romania. Unfortunately, some countries issue visas in a complicated manner, like the USA, Mexico and the UK. I couldn't figure out the logic behind giving a visa to someone when it comes to the States. Um, some um, people had all the documentation ready, with a clear history, with funds on the accounts and got rejected. And of course, some people are not going to the States for traveling, they are planning to stay there. And some of them got lucky and the embassy gave them a visa. So it's kind of tricky. But Georgians did find a solution here also. Some people are not entering the embassies on the territory of Georgia and they are doing it in France, Germany or other countries. And I have to say that it somehow works and almost 90% are getting a visa this way. In 2022, the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Georgia reported the visa-free regime between Georgia and UAE. Under the agreement, ordinary passport holders of the two countries will be able to enter without a visa transit and be in the territory of the state of the other party for not more than 90 days from the date of entry. A foreigner can get a Georgian passport after acquiring Georgian citizenship. It is possible under an ordinary procedure, simplified procedure, uh, as an exception or through restoration. As you can see, there are many visa-free countries in the world for Georgians, so you can easily find one that suits your needs uh, perfectly and start exploring them. If you're a holder of Georgian passport, share your experience with us uh, on what it's like to be a Georgian citizen in the comment section.